His Excellency Mr. Ban Ki-moon and the Just as the lack of development can feed the flames of conflict, economic and social progress can help prevent it and secure peace. Sustained, broadly-based development can develop to address the roots of conflict by such steps as ensuring the equitable sharing of wealth, better access to agricultural lands, strengthening governance and justice for all. Under Rule 37 of the Council's provisional... The population living in countries emerging from conflict should not be doubly affected. affected. First, par by devastating conflict, devastateurs, et ensuite, and par then notre difficulty by our difficulty à in harmonizing and actions, coordinating our activities to help these populations to build their future. People want to decide themselves how to live their lives. They want the opportunity to shape a better future. When people have little economic perspective and cannot participate in the political life of their country, this does not contribute to stability. On the contrary, repression of political participation, repression of human rights and economic freedom will lead to instability. The main point I would like to make in our debate today is that we can do more and we should be able to do better. We are not proposing to reconfigure the responsibilities of different UN organs or agencies, neither to transform this Council into a development program. But today's debate will, in our view, achieve its objective if it contributes to raising awareness on the importance of associating development to the security strategies we conceive towards sustainable peace. Ministers here present today. I must be to thank the Brazilian Presidency for the choice